I'm Ryan Lightfoot Brown. We're joined today by the elite rated Leslie Duncan of the Standard Life Investments UK Ethical Fund. Thank you for joining us, Leslie. Could you please explain to us your investment process? One of the key foundations of our investment process for our UK Ethical Fund is the fact that we do an annual survey of our investors in the fund and we test our positive and negative criteria um, through this survey and that really forms the basis of what the criteria for the fund will be. We do this on an annual basis. Then once that's done, that def defines what the universe of the stocks that we can invest in for the fund. And where are you finding opportunities at the moment? A lot of the opportunities for myself, um, I still really like the mid and small cap area. In terms of when I think about what may happen uh, in the wider economy, one of the things that I'm looking for is stocks that can grow in excess of the economy. So co companies that have got really good structural growth, they've got something that's really quite unique around their growth prospects, which means that if the economy does start to slow, we will, um, you know, these companies will demonstrate really good growth in excess of the market. Now, around 16% of your fund is in companies outside of the FTSE index. Can you explain to us why you're investing in those companies? A lot of those companies have actually started as smaller companies and they've really grown into to mid-cap companies. So, for example, um, we invested in Fevertree at the IPO. Um, that is an AIM-listed company. A lot of the stocks that are in that 16% are aim listed so fever tree has grown from being you know a tiny small company everyone knows fever tree to you know on, on your supermarket shelf to your pub and um, when you're buying a gin and tonic to now being you know you know a couple of billion market cap um, aim company now so that's a large part of um, the holdings within that section other companies that I've invested in, again, it's a bit of a structural growth company, is Boohoo. It's a name listed uh, company as well. Again, started as a small cap, is now a mid cap company. Um, you know, there's such structural growth in online shopping, and Boohoo has really captured that growth um, with their brand and the offering that they, they provide to their customers. Leslie, that's really great. Thank you very much for coming in. If you want more information on the funds, please visit fundcalibre.com.